Hello everybody, Shift here again with another Rogue Genesia run. And let's get to it right away. So today the plan is to get the achievement that says get 5 weapons to level 7, which is uh, I think pretty easy to do. So let's just chase that down and uh, hope we're gonna get, for, first of all, you know, the items. Uh, let's go here, Force Shop, would have liked to avoid it, but not really possible. Uh, yeah, let's go like this path. Uh, I would say let's go to the time fight and then let's transition over to the classics. And then we're gonna see at the end where we're gonna go with... So, uh, did I did I misclick anywhere? Nope, let's go. Let's actually go and see what we get. I would enjoy getting Katana right away because I still want to get the legendary Katana, but... Alas, uh, what has been a long time since I took it? You know what? Maybe I should go with Infinite Project Gods. It has been a long time since I got Pike, but... Let's get Bow. It has been a long time since I got Bow too. Let's just go with the Bow. I'm gonna chase down wherever it shoots because that's where the opponents should be. Clumsy. Throw the defense right away. Um, yeah, let's just go for it right away. Why not? Now, uh, yesterday, if you saw oh, blood pressure, we get damage multiplier, we lose health regen and uh, max health. That, that sounds good. I also enjoy quick. Project less speed, lose project less size, but project less speed is important. Compromise also good. Base damage though. Now let's go with this. Let's go with fast. So yesterday I did like a run. Uh, let's get Pike. As I said, we're gonna get whatever weapons we find, by the way. What it doesn't matter. I hope it's gonna be a katana, but if I don't find a katana, then so be it. So yesterday, I uh, tried to get the legendary katana going good damage and um yeah do you know i'm not sure if you saw yesterday's video but uh, i tried to get like the evolution of the katana and the thing is that <laughs> that specific evolution the one thing i was going for let's get the wind blade actually i don't want to get the wind blade because if i get the katana i would have like yeah i'm gonna avoid the wind blade that's the one where i'm gonna avoid let's go blood pressure if i get the katana i would like to get the other legendary upgrade that i haven't seen yet so um yeah that one legendary upgrade that I wanted, that one evolution, that katana plus fire spirit upgrade, that one upgrade, and exclusively that one, had a 1% chance uh, to drop. Uh, not uh, not in general, a 1% of what it should have. So if it had something like 10% chance to drop, it was 0.1. If it had 2% chance to drop, it was 0 0.02. So yeah, it's, so it was one, one hundredth. Yeah, a hundredth times less chance to find it. Um, uh, in comparison to what it should be, not in comparison to in general. So it's it was yeah borderline impossible to get, it, assuming that it was hard to get in the first place. So uh, yeah, there's that. Uh, did I get when, when did I get Pike? Wow, my memory is very really trashy. Uh, regardless, though, we're gonna go only for weapons. Today we're gonna do a five weapons run, maybe even six or seven. I don't care. Just go weapons, 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 and uh, damage, damage, damage. I guess. I'm not gonna get wind blades, man. The one weapon I don't want. Let's throw that away. Uh, let's get blood pressure. Why not lose a bunch of things to gain damage? That's always a, a good choice in any single game ever. Just go always anything other than uh, not damage. Are you serious with the wind blade today? We found heavy. I would say we roll it into another weapon because lucky is like that. Boom, easy recursion. We're gonna take that. It wasn't a weapon, but I tried. We'll get a chest. And uh, wow, we get more damage based on food found. Very nice. Uh, we got multi-handed, also very nice. We are powering up extremely fast here. And now imagine never ever finding uh, again anything. You know what? I would say black blood. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be able to build up my health again. Let's go damage. Uh, blood pressure. Man, this thing... This thing is killing our everything. Should I go for defenses? Oh, let's go for damage. YOLO it. Uh, project that size is important. Bow because weapon. Light-handed. I'm okay with attack speed. I prefer attack speed. This is a banished material. Pickup range is useless at this point. Let's go damage. I would say let's go castle. Build up our defense and our health again. I mean, I'm taking those blood pressures, but at some point we will die because of it. So if I don't have that much max life. So yeah, let's continue onwards. Let's continue onwards. I hope we're going to find more weapons. I hope the game isn't like, oh, you didn't pick up my wind blades. I guess I'm never going to show you anything ever again. Katana is the one and only thing I actually want, but if I don't get today's the Katana Legend, I'm gonna take it tomorrow. Let's go with Pike. Uh, yeah, let's go on in circles. I have been seeing some uh, some new channels are appearing, guys. Rogue Genesia is actually starting to pop off, and I'm super happy about it. I'm seeing smaller channels start covering it. Uh, people are getting careers build up based on this game. Um, I would say Sharp Edge over Piercing. Actually, let's get Sharp Piercing. Uh, let's get let's get. Nah, I don't care about Piercing. I mean, yeah, the arrows need piercing, but whatever. Oh, look at this guy. He has red life. 
So yeah, I'm super happy about it. Uh, that, that just goes to show how, how popular this game is going to be. And I think that's like always uh, for always a, a good metric. Like when I was seeing, you know, Vampire Survivors, so people started playing Vampire Survivors and I don't know, like two months later, boom, it became crazy. Let's get average, obviously. We want to get so many levels in weapons that we will not have. Eh, spear, spear, spear it is. I don't care. Let's go pike. Student for XP gain, I would say, yeah. Uh, Trade-off, we get attack speed for less projectiles. Hmm... I do enjoy this as an idea. Yeah, let, let's take that. Uh, let's level up the spear. I'm gonna get whatever weapons appear, okay? The only weapon I'm not gonna take is the wind blade. And once again, the reason for that is not because I hate the wind blade or anything. No, I think it's a pretty decent weapon. Although, it, it is ugly-ish. Because it shoots to the left and the right. Not ugly-ish. It's, uh, it's not ugly. It's hard to use, I would say. Because it only shoots left and right. Uh, but still, still, the reason is not that. I would take it even if that was the reason. I I want to get the legendary katana. That's what I want to do. So, I mean, yeah, that's it. That is my reasoning. Let's get the spear. I want to level up all my weapons. This is also a good uh, time to see if just leveling up weapons is enough to make you busted. Nice. Hypersonic. I would say yes to hypersonic. I see the pike, but let's get hypersonic. Let's start shooting out extremely fast blades and arrows. Compromise, we lose damage for projectiles. Honestly, I guess, yeah, because we had less than this much health. 2.5 less health, I guess, because of the multipliers. Whatever. We're here. Da -da 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 -da. I like that everything's shooting out extremely fast. So, yeah, I'm uh, I'm super excited about this, man. This game is about to launch, I don't know, in five days, three days, four days, six days. Depends on when I exactly upload this. Depends on what the date actually is. And uh, yeah, don't forget to wishlist it, so you, you know, you're gonna make the, the dev more excited about it, and also you will buy the game when it comes out, or you cannot buy the game. I mean, the wishlisting and buying is something different. Wishlisting is helping the dev, mostly the dev out. On the one hand, yeah, okay, wishlists help you out too, to see when the game launches, but it's, you know, it's just a... In my mind, it's a showcase to the dev that, yo dev, I, I care about this game, bring it out, or etc. Uh, even if you were not gonna buy it yourself, right? Even if you're like, I just like the game. Uh, that's how you get a huge wish list, by the way. <laughs> that's how you get a huge wish list. Just start wishlisting games that you believe would be awesome when they launched. And then, yeah, and then you get a huge list of thorns. We're gonna get thorns. It is, it is a weapon. I said every single weapon other than the one thing I don't care about. Let's get the XP multiplier. Let's destroy more elites and more elites. I see magnets. Let's pick up magnets. 3D2 level. Oh man, we're destroying people here. I remember the pikes. Good old pikes. I've forgotten you, my old friends. This is the other banish thing. Let's go spear. Once again, we're banishing pickup range. For anybody that doesn't know, we are banishing pickup range. Because I'm not swift anymore. <laughs> no, we're banishing pickup range because um, there is a card that's, uh, that is called... Uh, let's go with projectile size. With so many weapons, I, I mean, I already have 28% damage mitigation. Like, I don't think I need more. Um, what was the reason? Yeah, the reason is because there is a card called Student or something. Bookworm, Bookworm. That makes it so that you lose almost all your pickup range. And it's multiplicative. Let's get recursion. So that means that uh, you pretty much have no chance whatsoever to get a decent pickup range. Uh, increase damage if you take damage. Stone skin, tense. Let's just get a level up here. Let's level up the thorns. And I think we're good to go. Off to a relic. 50% XP gain. Insanely good. And recursion, I would say. I see the thorns, but we're gonna take the recursion. We want to keep up with the damage. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go to the dual fight, obviously. And uh, I would say, let's get this. Yeah, let's get the defenses. I mean, yeah, okay, obviously. I don't need that much defense when I have insane damage, but... Oh, Fire Spirit is here, and Perfection is here. I'm gonna go for the Fire Spirit. Although this is one of the best cards in the game, I'm gonna go for Fire Spirit. I am dreaming, man. I'm dreaming a lot, and I hope that we're gonna find Katana. I believe in it. I believe in my luck. I believe in my dream. And my dream is to get the legendary Katana to see what it looks like. So that um, I hope it's gonna be awesome or not. I wanted to test it yesterday in the infinite run. By the way, there seem, uh, yesterday I got like 40k souls from the infinite run. Let's go with speed. And not the infinite run, from the survival run. And... Uh, I the dev then like literally a couple hours later I guess uploaded a patch that said uh, the, uh, that they capped out how much damage you can do uh, how much uh, souls you can gain to ten thousand I got forty thousand by the way and I told him yo don't cap it man if somebody gets a perfect run you you know he should get rewarded ten thousand is a bit too little and he I think he just removed the cap and changed the multipliers but what I want to say here because I have gone full circle here until I say the one thing I want to say 
is that people were getting millions and billions of souls. And um, yeah, a lot of save files pretty much are now 100% complete. I don't know how they're going to fix that. I don't know what they're going to do with it. But um, yeah, I think maybe the solution would be something like... I don't know. I don't know what the solution could be. From these traces, I would say movement speed. It's fun to run around fast. And also hoping for the damage thing throw, the attack speed thing throw. So if, for example, you got a billion uh, meta progression currency, uh, when the game launches, you will have all that meta progression currency. And then, you know, you pretty much have literally everything in the game. <laughs> so, yeah, it makes sense that they nerfed that. But I mean, uh, getting 50,000 or 100,000, I think would be nice, you know. Uh, obviously, uh, let's go with XP multiple. I'm gonna find the ball later. Uh, obviously, uh, you know, you will unlock everything and then maybe you don't have any incentive to farm anymore. But, I mean, did anybody have an incentive to farm? I definitely didn't. I'm just playing the game because I'm having fun. So, why would I even care about the meta progression currency? Uh, let's get Thor. Actually, this gives attack speed and damage. I think I should take the Thorns. Start leveling up the Thorns. I need to get all my weapons level 7 for the achievement thing, so... Okay, double card, that's good. Let's get the good damage. Let's get the good health. Let's go the time fight. Fix me and everything. Oh, we didn't even get a level. Okay. I wasn't the assumption that you almost always get a level. Let's go bow. You almost always get a bow a level from that. I haven't found a single level on Bookworm yet. I did find the average pretty early. By the way, I, I was thinking... Uh, a new a new card idea. I'm not sure if the dev is still watching all these videos, by the way. I, I think he is. So, a new card idea. How is average? You know, you have average in the game that removes all crit related things and gives you a bunch of damage. You could also have something similar for defenses, like it removes every single thing that says defense or damage mitigation. And it gives you something similar or something that would... Like, what could it be? Um, it could be something like uh, the max damage you can take is capped to 10. That could be what it is. Uh, to 10% to of your max life. So, like, your maximum damage taken is capped at 10% max life. Or 20% max life. I don't know. You, you can decide what would be more balanced. Let's get this because it gives us more. Actually, let's fully reroll. Let's, uh, I would say let's get the damage multiplier. As this is harder to get. I see the bow. I see the bow. So, yeah. Something like that could be the choice. You know, uh, you, you no longer find defense upgrades. Your defense becomes zero and it locks down in zero at zero. Or, or your defense becomes, I don't know, minus 100. And um, you you no longer find defensive upgrades. But you... What is it called? But your, your damage that you can take is capped to 20% of your max life. So it pretty much changes your life. And instead of having numbers, etc. It's just you can take five hits. That's what your life transforms into. Because if you have like minus 100 defense, whatever hits you is going to hit you for 100 damage plus. So it's something like that. That, that could change. That, that, that's like a unique idea, I would say. And also it would change completely up a bunch of runs and a bunch of builds. And uh, I think it would be a fun idea. And then once again, it would be literally the same idea of average, right? Like if you have the levels to invest. Let's reroll here. Uh, I would say let's go damage and lose some stats. Ah, let's go damage and lose some stats. Yeah, if you have the if you have the levels and want to invest into defense, you would better you would better be off with going into the full on defense route with damage mitigation and with uh, you know flat defense etc etc. But if you just want to get some kind of defense item and don't care about defense in general, then you just take that thing. And, uh, you know, your defense becomes minus hard. Like, the whole gameplay changes. You now only have a flat amount of life. It's five. You have five life and that's it. Uh, I think it would be unique and weird. I don't know if it should be, like, a heroic or if it should be an ascended card or if it should be an epic card. But uh, it would be to the same... The idea is going to be that it's in similar fashion. By the way, I destroyed the elite. It, it is in a similar fashion of what uh, average does. Where it removes your crit chance completely. Let's reroll this. Dang it. It, re it removes your crit chance completely, but uh, for, uh, you know, for a, it uh, trades you with a 65% multiplicative damage for the rest of the game, right? So th that's my idea for defensive related things, I would say. I'm not sure if it is worth it. I'm not sure if it sounds busted or if it is busted. But I mean, if it is busted, you can just change the numbers around. Like, uh, you can take up to 33% of your damage. Overloaded. I don't want to lose attack speed. I don't enjoy my attack speed. I don't care about the rest ones. So, yeah, I don't know. I would like to hear some opinions on this, regardless of if the dev watches this ever or not. But, uh, you know, it, it just popped into my mind just now. Now, I, I was not planning into announcing this or anything, because if I was planning into announcing it, I would just send it to the dev right away, because we're talking. 
So, yeah, there's that. Um, yeah, I would like to hear opinions. And you know what? Not only that, you can also maybe express fire threat. You can also maybe express opinions about another similar idea, right? Like, anything that is unique, Bookworm is here. Nice. So, this is the thing I was telling you. Oh, this got buffed. This used to remove 50% uh, of your uh, pickup range. It was from 5, you went down to 2.5. And then from 2.5, you went down to 1.2. So, now it's from 5 to 3.8. That looks like a 3D 3% chance to me, right? It's 1.2. And this is 1.2 less, so 3 times 1.2 is... Um, f yeah, that, that's wrong. I'm, I'm doing more math wrong. Well, I, I don't really care about the math, honestly speaking. Uh, the pickup range is still butchered completely, so I'm not, I'm not, I'm sure I'm not gonna pick it up. But let's go and see where the magnet is, because I have a magnet somewhere. And our bookworm, we're gonna take our bookworm. Heavy is appearing pretty often today. Uh, did you see my pickup range get butchered even more? I didn't look at it. I didn't even look at it. But now we all borderline don't even have pickup range. I would say bow level up. Nice. Now we have the bow maxed out. So now I have uh, two weapons maxed out, I think. Maybe one. I'm not exactly sure. Let's get the fire spirit, obviously. So now I'm just missing the katana. I'm gonna still try to get a katana by rerolling some legendaries, maybe. Just saying. Maybe. Maybe. You never know. Okay. We're gonna go thorns. I don't care about turtle, honestly. Let's get the thorns maxed out. That's pretty important-ish. And also we have so much damage mitigation. Nothing really should be able to touch us. Uh, if I don't get the katana today, then I will play tomorrow's survival mode and we're gonna try to get it there because I would enjoy gaining, you know, that uh, sweet... Oh, money, 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 money. Ding, 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 ding. Let's go thorns. And you know where? I think we're gonna go here. We're gonna become rich and then we're gonna go off to the blacksmith so that the blacksmith gives us the katana to, hand, to my hands. Like, he's gonna be like, here, you want a katana? Here, take it. It, it is yours, Sift. Let's go Damascus Steel. Although I think we should have gone with flat damage. That was a choice there, but whatever, whatever. Sometimes I'm clicking too fast just because I see meme words. I'm making Damascus Steel, I mean, by the way. But let's go on. Or am I? I mean, I am calling its name out, and I think that's how things become a meme. Not that I'm a meme generating machine or anything. Or am I? I don't even know. Uh, Reroll. I mean, we're about to run out of rerolls here, but whatever. You'll let Trade off. Begin attack speed for projectile. I'm okay with that. I do enjoy my attack speeds. Projectiles, who cares? Who cares about projectiles when you shoot out a million per second? I mean, projectiles are still important, don't get me wrong. I really enjoy that we're getting like infinite elite spawns lately. And I also think I should definitely go into defense a bit more, especially percentage based defense. I shouldn't, um, yeah, I shouldn't YOLO this much. Thousand damage. Let's take it. Remove it from, uh, remove it from the rotation too. I still have magnets all around. Yeah, there are magnets over there. The most important part is to find food and eat it, as uh, food gives us percentage-based damage. Attack speed at long last, it's here. I was missing that thing. So now we're gonna get like 400% attack speed or something. Yeah, as I was saying, smaller YouTubers are creating careers out of this. Guys, it's, uh, it's your chance to join me in the ranks of YouTubing. Uh, how do you do it? It's very simple. Clickbait. First of all, clickbait. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's go with... I have 205 attack speed if I take stone hand. Let's take stone hand. It's so many projectiles. 250 attack speed, definitely worth it. Uh, first thing you need to do, clickbait title and uh, 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 screen, uh, well, the thumbnail. That's the first thing you need to do. Now, when I say clickbait, I do not mean lie. I mean only that, you know, it has to be it has to be lit up. It has to be, uh, you know, I don't, I don't know, man. Just just, just look whatever else, uh, whatever, whatever everybody else is doing and just copy them. It's as simple as that because there is no copying in the space of YouTube and internet. Let's be serious about this. Uh, let's get defense. Let's see what here. Yeah, let's go here. There is inspiration. There is, uh, oh, I saw it and I liked it and I did the same thing. But I, I mean, what? What is this? A limit break, card selection, Kunai Katana. Easy. I told you I'm going to get it. I told you so. 14k on this. Why is this red? Because I don't have a single weapon leveled up? Or just because they want it to be red? Because I do have the pike leveled up and the bow. Um... Yeah, let's uh, let's get a super pike to see what it looks like. Are you serious right now? Where's the pike? Where's the pike? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm screaming like that. I guess bow. I'm so disappointed. I wanted to have a super pike. And I can't even rarity reroll any of these into a super pike. Uh, I guess the bow. I guess the thorns because it takes like... Oh, it gives us more defense. Okay. Kunai, card selection. That's the katana. Wait, uh, how many weapons do I have? Uh, bow is one, pike is two, uh, katana is three, and uh, this is four, and spear is five. Okay, we have five weapons. We don't need any more weapons. I just need to level up 
my uh, katana as fast as possible. 7,000. <laughs> Game be like, give me the katana here. And another 7,000. Wow. What are the chances? There have to be some specific reasons why that happened. Dev, was that a reason why that happened? Or is that like... Like, is it fixed that we get this thing? Like, uh, is it guaranteed or what? What happened there? Anyway, so we have guaranteed chance to... It's 100% guaranteed that we're gonna pick up the thing I want. That being the legendary katana. Because I already have the flame level 3. And I also have... Another thing, absorb everything at the end, very nice. Let's go Katana, obviously, we want to bring that to level 7. And we also are guaranteed to get the achievement going. Mm, I would say we go this path. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And then here, oh, 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 what crazy path is this, man? Where's the... No, why are you over there? Dang it. Let's go like this. Oh, I mean, this also looks like a crazy path in the first place, so... Who cares? And then the rest is the same. Ah, almost the same. I guess we're gonna go here. Yeah, it's it's literally almost the same. It's literally almost the same. Uh, yeah, that, that sentence does not really make that much sense, but whatever. Whatevs. Let's go to the right. Because we want to go to this dual fight there. Okay, let's continue attacking everybody. And just continue onwards. Just destroying people. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna read some opinions about things I said just before this below. But, I mean, that is my opinion. It is, it is true. That, uh, in my opinion, especially in this circle, right? Like, uh, <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't want to analyze this anymore. If anybody wants to analyze it further, I guess you can pin me in my Discord. Ping me in my Discord. And uh, we can open a discussion about anything that we want. Maybe. Maybe. <sighs> or just comment down below and have, like, a whole discussion with anybody in the comments. That's also a solution, you know, about anything I said. But I do believe that right now is the prime time for anybody that wants, like... Uh, I I'm telling you, this here... The Rogue Genesia, if the dev continues what he's doing, and if the hype stays high, this is gonna be another Vampire Survivors 2.0. And I I mean, I don't mean with that they're copying. I mean that they're gonna become famous, or at least I hope they're gonna become famous. And, you know, like, with Vampire Survivors, Dex became famous, and, like, another person called Never Nathaniel became famous, and then, like, Asmogold came along and just boosted everybody that was playing this, and everybody and their grandmother were playing that, then that game, too. I hope this game is also gonna get that um, treatment. I mean, it's a bit more of a roguelike, so things like Asmogold playing it are pretty low, pretty slim. Like, I, th I don't think Asmogold ever played things like... I don't know, um, Slay the Spire, or hey, I'm not sure if you ever played games like these, like true roguelikes with mapping, etc. But uh, I still do believe that this is going to become famous within the circle of people that do play these games. Like, it's so different than the rest. Uh, it, it's so different and so much better uh, base-wise. Like, the, the whole idea around this game is completely different. I don't even know why anybody else didn't do this. Like, I, I don't, I really don't understand why not a single other game that copied Vampire Survivors didn't decide to... Uh, we're gonna go with a pathing system, and uh, we're gonna do this and that, and you know, classic case. Maybe, may, I guess maybe Just King tried to do that, but Just King isn't really uh, an everything uh, explodes around you type of game. Let's go Katana, and now, first of all, we've got the War Dog, which is, as I said, the achievement we were going for, and now we're gonna, literally, first thing we're gonna get is going to be the Katana. Trust in my luck. Now that, now that it is uh, reverted into its correct percentages, uh, I'm assuming that we're gonna get it right away, because I am lucky, and luck is what carries me through everything. And if it's not, then uh, you never see the videos most of the time. <laughs> Unbelievable, am I right? Content creators, um, what is it called? What is it called when you tell your bad content and only upload your good content? I'm not I'm not talking about wins or loss, I'm talking about good or not. It's, um, uh, come on, I know the word for it. Uh, it's Steam Curator, Curator. Content creators curating their own content. Unbelievable. Am I right? Am I right? Who would have thunk? Let's continue destroying everything. Up and a little. Oh, this is a very durable elite. Let's not forget that I don't have anything defensive-wise other than that uh, 35, 40% damage mitigation. Uh, oh, yeah, that, that 35 damage. Oh, we got the magnet there, so we got our XP at the end. Let's go pick it up. Whoop, not even a single level. No, 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 it's happening, it's happening, it's happening. Katana, boom. This did not count. Uh, let's go with light armor for even more defense and even more movement speed because moving fast is fun. Gas, gas. Oh, by the way, I have learned that the lyrics are not the gas, gas, gas. I thought it was don't take your foot off the gas. I think it sounds better than whatever the normal lyrics are. I don't know what the normal lyrics are, by the way, because my memory is trash and uh, the don't take foot of your gas has ingrained in my mind so much that I straight up will never ever be able to learn the right lyrics. 
ever in my whole life. And the game, the, the song is even so old that it isn't even playing anywhere to say that, oh, I listened to it and yeah, actually the lyrics are different. You know what I mean? Like when a, when a song plays somewhere and you sing it wrong, but then later learn what the normal lyrics are and then you hear it again, you're like, yeah, um, yeah actually now that I'm listening to it, yep, these are the lyrics. And then you actually learn the light lyrics, but correct lyrics but if this song doesn't play and you just read them and then you sing the song on your head it's it's a bit harder to sing i did ahead i i, I went ahead and listened to the song again just to hear what it actually says by the way i'm talking about the random song like what uh but yeah why 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 am i doing that like my, my my random discussions are a bit too random sometimes i think i don't know you guys decide on that too you guys can tell me. Do you agree? Disagree? Do you want me to talk about the game itself? We are destroying opponents. We're running through. <laughs> I'm taking it again. Um, by the way, I have to say, multi-handed. Let's go. I have to say, five weapons run is the play, man. With five weapons, I don't feel like I have gotten that much, that many attack-related buffs, other than the fact that I have 10 base damage and a thousand percent multiplicate damage multiplier. Other than those, and also I have plus five projectiles. But other than those, I would say I don't have got, I haven't gotten that many damage buffs. Uh, I think it's the weapons that are carrying us. I'm kidding, by the way. Obviously, obviously, right? And uh, what gave it away? Was it the other than those? <laughs> Was it the? Oh, by the way, I have all this damage. Ah. It's because I have the relic. It's because I have the relic that says that we gain uh, damage based on how much food we fought. We food we fought. <laughs> how much food we ate. I think that is the play here. No, uh, oh, oh, let's run. Let's run. Come on. Nice. Got everything. Oh, 18k gold, by the way. I'm gonna become super rich. Come on, man. I trusted you, game. Here it is. Here it is. It's incoming. What is this? 50% more damage. Yeah, whatever. Come on. Boom. Easiest not get the card you want of my life. Off to the left. Obviously, we're gonna go relic chasing. We're gonna go attack. Cardio. I'm not gonna go cardio. It's serious. I'm gonna go. Yeah. I guess we're gonna go cardio. This is such a small increase. And here we're gonna go projectile speed. <laughs> I don't know, man. All of these choices. I mean, I already have 40% damage mitigation, it seems, so I don't see... Oh, that was a big hit. Okay, and that was a bat. Imagine how much damage the skeleton is going to do to us. I would say the skeleton is going to maybe bring us down to half-life with one touch. With one touch of the skeleton. -la -la. Let's continue onwards. I thought yesterday that the colors of the numbers mean how quickly you can destroy an opponent. Like red means one shot, yellow me um, yellow means two shot, and white means three sh uh, three shot and more, and that's why everything is white. But the thing is that oh, yeah, I was about to say the thing is that the, whenever I hit something with the pike, it's an insta kill, and now I see six hundred damage shots. No, why why are the numbers in the bats also white? I don't get it. I guess that is not it. It's that's the simplest solution. <laughs> The, the Arkham's Razor, so to speak. Arkham's Razor or something else? There is one Razor that's supposed to be the simplest solution is also the correct one. And then there is another one that says that... Um, however, uh, if you if you delete everything that is not... Uh, if you... If you, if you check everything that is not true, then the only thing that is left it has to be true, something like that. I'm super duper paraphrasing, that is not even remotely close to what it's called. I think that, that might just be from Sherlock Holmes, though. That might not be an actual quote that means anything. Uh, whoop, nice. Increase monster by 20%, reduce your health, though. Very, very, very good. Overloaded. We lose attack speed, we double our projectiles. At this point, though, with yeah, with, with so many projectiles that we have, I think I should take this. Like, I have so many projectiles. We're going to take this. 12 projectiles. This, uh, this is literally double damage. Okay, card selection, whatever. Uh, area for the, for the blade. And movement speed for us. I mean, this is also movement speed better one even come on man where's my legendary heavy no stop giving me heavy uh why would i not take heavy by the way it increases knockback base damage project lets us bigger movement speed i will just lose a bit of movement speed yeah let's take heavy what am i even doing i mean i, I don't even have the thing that gives us uh let's go here obviously for the attack speed <laughs> oh this guy's durable <laughs> wait did i lose damage I don't think I lost damage. The fact that everything shotguns like that. Ah, uh, the pikes. Ah, uh, the pikes. I want to see the future of this game, man. I want to see the future of this game. 
where uh, where you can get even more projectiles. Let's get attack speed, obviously. And the pikes are like around you as if it's like uh, what is it called? As as if it's uh, as if you're the sun. <laughs> like everything around you just get hits by the spikes. The pikes would be so fun. Maybe that could be its legendary, man. Maybe that could be its legendary. Uh, pikes get uh, get double or triple uh, amount of projectiles from your projectile plus, and then it just shoots everything around you it's like. When it's like a super sun. I love it. I would love it so much. Uh, this is this is stupid, by the way. <laughs> now I just need fractal, and we're gonna have a million spikes all over the place, and I love it. Let's get hit by this guy. Okay, it didn't do that much to us, honestly speaking. So we got hit by we got hit by uh, this skeleton. Did a little little linton. Did a linton. Let's get range. Let's get food because food is damage for us. Okay, two card selections because we have the relic that says that we get two cards on those stages. I'm not gonna get the cleaver, although the cleaver is gonna shoot out like 70,000 weapons, but I'm not gonna take it. Let's go with more area. Why didn't I take the cleaver now? You might ask. Let's get perfection for the attack speed. The reason is very, very simple. I didn't take the cleaver because the less weapons you have, lightning boots for the ashes, the higher the chance you're gonna find a new weapon is. This is crazy multiplier, but we lose attack damage. Wow, this is crazy damage, but we lose projectiles. No, I like my fun build with my projectiles. Let's go for base damage. I like my fun projectile build. A selection. Uh, Damascus Steel. And uh, I guess Ice Spirit to remove it from rotation. I don't really care about this, honestly. I wish I don't care about the knife. Let's go to the right. Come on. Give us. Okay, shops are better. Fair enough. Perfection. I'm going to take that. Okay, first of all, just so you guys know, we have a... No! I was about to say, we have a guaranteed evolved weapon in the blacksmith. Well, that dream is dead. Please game, dear game, I have I don't know how many levels. My beloved game, please, please. No, it's not giving it to me. I don't think it's gonna give us to us. I guess we're gonna try tomorrow again. <laughs> I guess we're gonna try again tomorrow. <laughs> On the survival mode, I would assume. Hopefully we're gonna get it. Let's continue destroying everything. Oh, oh what's happening? What's happening? Excuse me, uh, game. Game. Okay, thank you for the fix. Something happened. I, I think I think I clicked somewhere off screen or something, and uh, I was running towards the bottom left. Where's my cursor, man? Okay, pop right here. This found it. Sometimes I'm just straight up not finding my cursor. By the way, there is a cursor setting. Let's go here. Uh, maybe I should use it and make the cursor bigger or something. But nah, who cares, really? At the end of the day, I'm not even using the cursor that much, unless I have pikes, or uh, yeah, unless I have pikes, pretty much. I mean, even the kunai is that you're supposed to target, even those, like, who cares, I don't need to target them. Let's continue going around, destroying everything we find. Nice, you're toast, bats are toast. This is a, yeah, this is a, one of those stages. I just realized we are in a swarm stage. Single-handed. Wow, th this is almost double damage. Actually, double damage is 3,400, so this is a bit less than 3,400, and we lose less than half our projectiles. I think this is the play. Let's just take it. I think this is the play, man. I know, I know, projectiles fun, hurpa durpa, but still, I think this is the play. And also, it's gonna make it so we get more XP because of the overkill damage. So, that's also very important. Oh, we're losing life from mages. Man, if I don't get the legendary, I'm gonna be disappointed. Tomorrow, another run with a katana. Although, as you see, I'm not trying to force a katana. If we find the legendary, we find it. Otherwise, we're still having our fun here with our 5-weapon run. Could have had a 10-weapon run, maybe, but still. Not 10-weapon run, a bit hard, but... Ah, six weapon one with a with a cleaver could have been achieved. Uh, let's get to project. Oh no, I should have gotten the damage. Why did I take that? I was a bit slow on reading. Doesn't really matter though. I don't think it's a big difference. Did I just consume all of them? Nope. We still have a magnet over there. I think destroying everything we find. Running towards opponents. Whoop, let's run into them. I mean, if I run into them, even the spikes are gonna do a bit of damage at least. I really enjoyed yesterday's uh, f uh spikes firework of madness. That was crazy powerful. Maybe I should have that as a thumbnail. Yeah, maybe I should remake the thumb yesterday's thumbnail. Virus works of madness. But the thing is that I had that at the very- Yes! Yes! Yes, we found it. Evolution of a Katana Fire Spirit. Every slash now possesses AOE damage. 4,000 damage. 0 0.10 attack speed delay. 11 enemy slash. Let's see this. No! 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 Don't do this to me! Don't do this! There is no other fight after this. Card selection. Uh, I'm gonna go penetration, I guess, just to remove from rotation. No, don't do this to me. Okay, there might be another fight here. I'm gonna go to the might be another fight. I don't care about this. Let's go. Yes! We got another fight. We're gonna see the new weapon. Let's go here. Light armor, whatever. Uh, um, I'm trying to, on purpose, not hit anything. 
I see some mini explosions. Is that it? Some mini explosions? I guess it's the some mini explosions. I guess you're supposed to have bigger what? Uh, I would assume that you need bigger projectile size or bigger... Yeah, I don't know what exactly you would need to make these explosions bigger. I see them. They're like mini slashes that explode everything around them. We're gonna be able to see it at the boss because uh, the boss gets hit multiple times. Even if it's in the state of damage immunity. So we will be able to do that. But um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I should have gone to the shop though now that I'm thinking about it. Because I could have bought like upgrades on it. I'm gonna be lucky enough. I'm gonna get the upgrades in the next shop. I'm a bit sad that we were not in the blacksmith though. But whatever. Just continue onwards with what we're doing. Yeah, I see the explosions. I see the explosions. It's nice. Does also 12 dashes. Everything around us just explodes. It's not as awesome as the other one was. But maybe that's because I don't have weapon size. Or, or because I haven't leveled it up again enough. So that it gets weapon size. Maybe it's one of the two. At least we got the weapon though. Seems awesome. Let's continue destroying everything. Would have been fun if I could have had it from the get-go. You know, maybe I should do tomorrow a run with this weapon only. Like, explosive katana only run. And see how it is. Do you want that? Do you want that? Comment and tell me. Do you want tomorrow a, an explosive katana only run? I can easily do that. Like, I can easily force a weapon just to showcase it. It's very easy to do. Uh, okay, we're gonna go here. Increase area-based attacks for area weapons. Off to the shop where we're gonna find a million katanas. The Mask of Steel! And uh, what else? First of all, we have 82,000. Perfection is something I could take. Easier time to get legendary cards. Uh, you know, double card selection. Since when? Okay, let's get the Mask of Steel. Let's take Perfection. And uh, let's get into this. So let's take this. I'm trying to remove these things from rotation. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Perfection... 1000 or 50 versus katana so this gets more range more slashed per enemy even less cooldown even crazier damage reroll there are katana anywhere no katana anywhere double damage i'm gonna take the double damage i don't care about that uh let's take that for a thousand over level service is useless for us card selection i guess the muscle steel card selection i guess the muscle steel i don't need the level service one again katana is here 8k we're gonna buy it so from 0 0.8 to 0 0.8 what more range, 15,000 damage, more percentage based damage, whatever. Uh, card selection one. Pretty useless. Let's go with 15,000 damage. Um, also pretty useless. Uh, let's go with uh, base damage up. Yeah, this is like a 10% damage increase, by the way, because from 15 base damage, we go to 50 15. That's 10%. Actually, wait, is it? No, 10% would be. Yeah, 10% would be 16.50. So this is 0.3%. Uh, 3%, I guess. Whatever, man. Whatever, whatever. That, that doesn't really matter. Katana 7k. Let's buy it. Um, double HB region. I don't care about those. Let's just get new cards. Are you kidding me right now? Fractal. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm accepting it. Uh, with 12k, YOLO it. The Katana's here, of course. I'm crying, but let's just buy two cards and hope for the best. Nope. Percentage base damage. Everything's breeze damage, by the way. 16,800 watts. <laughs> what is this even saying? Let's go. 16,000% damage. Oh, they changed how fractal looks. They changed how fractal looks. Look how it looks. Look how it looks. I love it. Okay, let's see how the explosion look. This this is it. This here is it. Wait, does the explosion happen? I see the explosion happen. Boss is dead. I did like 98,000 damage there. Or, or 980 or something. I like that the new uh, things happen. Yeah, I did not really feel the weapon, okay? And I think you guys also didn't feel it. I did enjoy, though, how this run was going. I did also enjoy the whole idea of having a million weapons. I did not know that this is so powerful, but it is. Shield coins gained 2,000. I'm, I laugh every time. Uh, but at least that's going to be enough for us to level up one thing. Now, would that be a reroll? Would that be crit chance? Would that be a rarity increase? Or would that... Now, obviously, we don't have choice for those. I would say let's go with the reroll. As I am most of the time playing average anyway. So, who cares about the crit chance? Honestly. And, uh, yeah. Most likely tomorrow... So, actually, I want to hear some comments. Do you want me to try this build and only katana build tomorrow in maybe the survivals mode? Do you want me to try and only katana build in the normal mode? Or do you want me to just do a normal run and whatever happens, happens, you know, and try to not force anything at all? Uh, those are the choices pretty much. Now, if nobody decides, I'm going to decide on my own, obviously. <laughs> and uh, let's see what we unlocked here as last but not least. This, you know, murder. We had murder. This thing's... Yeah, this is an Ascendant card that's pretty much completely busted for defensive builds. But uh, that's not what I unlocked. I unlocked some kind of blade that looks like the... Where is this thing? Accumulation. So this is what we unlocked. 140 projectile size. So this is 40% more projectile size. I'm assuming it's multiplicative. 
1,700... What? What? From 300, which is my base damage, to 1,700... What? 500%? What is this? What? The? Five times? No, six, six times. Six times multiplier. And you lose half your attack speed. That's if you level it up to the max, by the way. If you level it up to the max... You gain a pretty sizable projectile size increase. You get an insane seven, six times damage multiplier. And then you get 40% knockback, useless. And then you lose half your attack speed. Yeah, busted. What do you mean six times damage, man? And you lose half your attack... Not half, more than half. You lose about 60% of your attack speed. Um, Is it busted? Is it though? I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. When I'm gonna find it, I might use it. We're gonna see in general. Um, so yeah, I think that's going to be it. Once again, uh, if you enjoyed, drop a like on the channel. If you want to see more, you can subscribe too. That's on you. And uh, yeah, the game's about to launch, guys. Subscribe, like, wishlist it. It's happening. It's happening. Uh, also, I'm going to give like a bunch of keys away when the game actually launches. So keep an eye out for that. It's most likely going to happen over at my Discord channel. Uh, because YouTube has its like rules and regulations and whatnot, and I don't want to deal with it. And uh, yeah, I think that is it pretty much. Once again, thanks for watching. Thanks for the Patreon supporters and all the membership supporters. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, uh, thanks for watching. And see you guys around.